So enforced disappearances is a major human rights issue around the world. Uh, people being abducted, kidnapped, disappeared. Uh, it's an issue in many countries. It's a particular issue. One of the largest uh, countries in terms of number of cases for this is Sri Lanka. Uh, estimates from Amnesty International are 60 to 100,000 cases of, of people affected. And of course, uh, the effects on their families and wider communities of people uh, being disappeared in forced disappearances. Uh, and this is an issue that uh, requires more attention and a stronger response internationally. Uh, so there's a group of people here in Canada uh, walking from Brampton to Ottawa and then some others that are walking from Quebec City to Ottawa to raise awareness about enforced disappearances in Sri Lanka and to present a petition uh, to the government. And I want to salute and celebrate the efforts uh, of these great Canadians bringing attention to this important issue. Uh, and we have a long tradition in Canada, being such a, a vast, uh, geographically separated country of people walking or running long distances to bring attention uh, or to raise money for important causes. Uh, this uh, tradition uh, goes back to Terry Fox, who ran across Canada uh, to bring awareness and raise money uh, for cancer research. Uh, so it's a, it's a great Canadian tradition for people to uh, make this, this personal physical sacrifice to walk or run long distances between cities as a way of raising awareness and raising support for important causes. So uh, I salute uh, these, these great Canadians for participating in this tradition of raising awareness in this way and in particular for trying to bring more heat and light to this issue of enforced disappearances in Sri Lanka and I'm hopeful uh, the government of Canada will receive that petition and respond to it uh, and take stronger action uh, to push for a, a greater response internationally to the human rights situation in Sri Lanka, enforced disappearances uh, and, and many other issues uh, where minority communities in, in Sri Lanka are concerned about the continuing abuses of fundamental human rights of minorities and in fact in many cases a worsening situation uh, for minority rights. These issues require our engagement and our response as parliamentarians, as Canadians uh, and of people all over the world.